Cameroon president Paul Bia is dead. See what was revealed amid rumor. Cameroon president Paul Bia is dead. See what was revealed amid rumor. To my dear listeners, from wherever you listen from, please stay tuned as I read today's news. President Paul Bia's prolonged absence from public events has ignited speculation and concern among Cameroonians regarding his health and governance capabilities. At 91 years old, Bial is not only the world's oldest head of state, but also Africa's second longest serving president, having held power since 1982. Bial's recent travels included an official mission that began in France and later took, and later took him to China in early July. However, he notably missed significant international gatherings such as the UN General Assembly and the La Francophonie summit in France. Official statements indicated that he chose to rest in Switzerland instead of attending this event, raising eyebrows and foiling rumors about his health. Concerns about Bia's ability to govern have intensified due to his advanced age and extended absences. Sources close to the presidency have cited health reasons for his lack of public appearances, with reports suggesting that he is struggling with various medical issues, including chronic high blood pressure and memory problems. Such health challenges have led critics to question whether he can effectively lead the nation. Past controversies surrounding Bia's foreign trips have also resurfaced, with some accusing him of seeking medical treatment abroad, while the Cameroonian healthcare system faces significant challenges. Critics argue that his absences could destabilize the country, especially given the political uncertainty surrounding his potential successors. In light of Bia's ongoing absence, public anxiety about Cameroon's political figure has grown. Speculation has emerged regarding possible succession plans, with some suggesting that France may favor Bia's eldest son, Frank Emmanuel Bia, as a successor to ensure continuity. This has sparked debate on social media about whether such a transition would be beneficial or simply perpetuate the status quo. The government silence on Bia's condition has only deepened public unease. Lawyer Christian 
into being publicly called for transparency? Urging officials to clarify whether the president is on vacation or on well. His plea reflects a broader desire among citizens for clear communication. Regarding their leaders' health and applications for governance. As rumors swirl about Bia's potential demise or incapacitation, political insiders speculate that a plan may already be in place for a transition of power. Some reports indicate that Robert Inkili, Bia's brother in law, could serve as interim president if necessary. However, opposition leaders like Maurice Camtol are likely to contest any attempt at, the, at this dynastic succession, advocating instead for democratic reforms. Be as historical significance cannot be understated. He took office on November 6, 1982, after serving as Prime Minister from 1975 to 1982. His tenure has been marked by both stability and criticisms over governance practices. As he approaches the next presidential election in 2025, calls for him to run against persist despite growing concerns about his health. To my dear listeners, now I've come to the end of